African Christian University is a tertiary um, education institution that's been established by the Reformed Baptist Churches in Zambia. The idea came up in uh, 2008. Um, it took us a number of years to finally open doors. And in uh, 2016, we then had our initial uh, group of students. The university primarily uh, aims to develop um, a, a whole new generation of young people who would understand uh, God's world and their own careers from a biblical worldview. And so that's really our uniqueness. That's where we emphasize. It's not just a Christian university for teaching people with some devotional exercises by the side. It is one where all the courses are deliberately taught from a biblical worldview. Our goal in bringing students into the African Christian University is primarily to bring in Christian students because we realize that only those who are Christians can ultimately be appropriately discipled from a Christian perspective, from a biblical worldview. However, what we've done is our first year, which is really a, a kind of pre-university um, program, we call it the Scholars Program, is one that we keep open to all with an emphasis on those who are Christians. So we, have, we aim for 70% being Christian. The African Christian University is currently renting premises. We, we're renting five houses down the same road. Uh, this coming year we'll have to add two more houses just so that we can uh, provide room for everything we're doing. Uh, we are currently purchasing land, uh, 89 acres of land just outside Lusaka. And uh, we're hoping in due season to build the university there. The four courses that we are offering at the African Christian University are agriculture, uh, business, education, and theology. And these are all in a four-year degree program. We have since also begun a seminary and we're hoping that that will then provide a Master of Arts in Pastoral Theology and in Institutional Chaplaincy. We're very grateful that we have uh, Dr. Vodi Bokam with us. Uh, we were quite pleasantly surprised at his willingness to come and help us. And uh, while he's with us, he's providing leadership to the Theological Department, and he's also providing leadership to the um, postgraduate uh, studies that we're offering in theology. Our number one plan really is that for the next year or two, we maintain the current premises because while we are raising funds and building, we can only be in this one place. And so we're hoping that by the end of the next two years, we can then migrate to what will be available at that time on the land that we are presently purchasing. Our number one plan really is to add more areas of study. And we do need to begin working in such a way that we begin to uh, pay, remunerate, our lecturers. We definitely uh, need ongoing help because what we've done is we have keyed the level of payment by students a little less than what is the actual cost. And then as a university, we try to find that balance. So it would be a great help uh, if individuals could come alongside us there. The way in which people outside Zambia can get involved in the SU, first of all, I would really encourage them to simply visit our website. 
we're constantly adding various needs that are currently there. So they may just find that some of the needs that are being highlighted, they can immediately key in.